Hello and welcome to another video from Natasha Lee. Now today I want to introduce you to these Magpie Beauty Dusts and these are absolutely amazing. I've had these for quite some time and they were hugely popular in my salon, particularly the Too Faced collection that I'll show you in a minute. I'm going to swatch all of these for you and show you how versatile they really are. These dusts are just like pigments which means they can be used in gel, acrylic, gel polish and regular nail polish too. The Too Faced collection all look like they're white but in actual fact they add a different hue to each colour. Here we can see each of the four dusts over deep navy blue. The navy blue on its own is on the far left. Then we have Iris, Vera, Jade and Opal. Next I've applied all the dusts over pure white. We can see pure white here on the left. Then Iris, Vera, Jade and again Opal. Next I've applied the dusts over a deep purple. On the far left you can see the deep purple. Then we have Iris, Vera, Jade and Opal. Next I'm applying over red. On the far left we have the red. Then we have Iris, Vera, Jade and Opal. Now I'm applying the dusts over a teal. On the far left we have the teal and then Iris, Vera, Jade and Opal. Now I'm applying the dusts over a very very pale blue. To the left you can see the base colour and then we have Iris, Vera, Jade and Opal. Next I've applied over this beautiful dusky pink. To the far left you can see the colour on its own which is the dusky pink. Then we have Iris, Vera, Jade and Opal. Now we have the dusts over a pastel yellow. To the far left is the pastel yellow and then Iris, Vera, Jade and again Opal. Now I'd like to introduce you to the Magpie Beauty dusts in the coloured range. First we have Connie and on the left I've shown you my plain colour that I've applied the dust over and on the right it's the dust over the colour. Nora is a beautiful beautiful shimmery lilac and here you can see it over bunny hopping. Rita is a pinky red with a gold hue running through it. Tiara is my favourite from the collection and it's a most beautiful antiqued silver. The camera really does not do this one justice. Here we have Fern which is a beautiful bright spring green. The next two lots of swatches are both olive but I wanted to show you what a versatile colour this was. First I've put it over this beautiful peppermint colour and you can see it tones it down slightly and has a lovely shimmer. And here we have it over a mushroom sort of brown where it turns very gold khaki. It really is incredibly versatile. Next we have Gloria which is a really vibrant yellow gold. Amber is a really rich bronzy terracotta and looks absolutely amazing over the deeper oranges and browns. And finally we have Sky which is a beautiful very sort of summer's day blue shimmer. I've applied it here over a pastel blue so you can see the richness in the colour. The Magpie dusts can be used over regular nail polish, gel polish, in acrylic and in gels. 
If you want to use an acrylic or gel, then the ratio is one third dust and two thirds product. But first I'm going to show you how to apply over regular nail polish. After applying two coats of nail polish and allowing to dry fully, you are ready to apply your foil adhesive. I'll put full links in the description of where you can purchase all the products that I've used. When your foil adhesive is fully dry, simply pick up some of the magpie dust on a brush, pat it over the nail lightly and then brush off the excess. Then simply finish off the look with a slick of top coat. I'm using the Setch Feet top coat. This has a nice thick layer which is ideal for going over dusts and glitters. Next I'm going to show you how to apply over gel polish. Apply two layers of gel polish curing each layer. After you've cured your second layer of gel polish, go straight in with your magpie dust on a brush and pat into that sticky layer. Pat it over the surface of the nail and then brush off the excess. Then you're ready to apply your top coat. Apply one or two layers, whichever you prefer, but make sure that you cure each layer individually. And here we have the finished look of the Magpie Dust over gel polish. And here side by side we have the Magpie Dust in Iris, on the left over regular polish and on the right over gel polish. Thank you very much for watching, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Full details of all the products is in the description below. And don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you very much.